Yep. So let's try, I want to see if you're able to see the chart that I'm holding here. So I'm going to pop. Is this the, uh, as much magnification as it'll allow for the moment? Uh, no, 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 not at all. So we'll go, we'll zoom in quite a bit when we're on the chart. I did okay. zoom in quite a bit on Vicky, but I backed out a little bit so it would give you more field of view. Okay. Now, can you see the number that I'm holding? Um, a chart with a big dark almost. number on it? I, I can... What about now? There we go. I would probably say it's a seven. You're right, it is a seven. Okay. Okay. I'm going to give you this. Or actually, no, you're holding it with both hands. That's okay. That is a four. Okay. Now, are you having to look around quite a bit to see that it's a four? No, it's uh, the one of the major things with me is uh, my stagmus. So I have to kind of give it a minute to focus. Okay, yeah, no problem. Take your time. That is a three. Good. That is a six. Good. Now it's starting to get a little small. There's three numbers on this page, one at the top and two at the bottom. Okay, so that is two on the top. Okay. Okay, bottom left or your right. And then eight. Good job, beside that to the right. Doing great. Same thing, one at the top, two at the bottom. Okay. I, I think that's the one on the top is a four. Mm -hmm. Below that. Below to my left, your right is a six. Great. And over to the right. That is a what about here? Okay. I think I'm at the top. You're at the top. That is an eight. Mm -hmm. My shaky hands are not helping. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that is a three. Page of numbers has three rows on it. So you just want to start at the top and go across each row. Oh, okay, so where's the first on the top? Right there, that's the first one. That is a seven. Mm -hmm. That is a two. Mm -hmm. That is a six. Great, if you go down a little bit lower, just lower your head just a tad and go over to the left. Right there, there's the beginning of the next one. That is a nine. Mm -hmm. That's a three. Mm -hmm. That's a five. Good job. If you lower your head just a little bit more, go over to the left. Right at the beginning of the page, one more. There you go. That is a eight. Mm -hmm. Is it a four? That 
one is a seven. Fantastic. We've got one more page. Can you read the top line of this page? Up a little higher. Oh, just down, just a smidgen. Right there, that's the beginning. Okay. That. It's okay if it's too difficult, just let me know. That one's just a smidge out of reach. I've, I'm i gonna take a guess and I'm say it's a six. Okay, so I'm gonna reset you. So if you take the glasses down, so put east sight down, mm -hmm. and look with your regular vision. You went from 2600 to 2120. Wow. Huge improvement. Oh my gosh. Huge. Huge, huge, huge. Oh my gosh. Wow. That's fantastic. Oh. When is the lot? Have, have you ever been able to read at 2120 before? Well, the thing is, is that over the last seven years, um, mm -hmm. My vision has gradually decreased due okay. to Conan rod dystrophy. Right. Uh, and that's been with decreases in my vision. I also don't have color perception. I have grayscale color blindness. Mm -hmm. um, and I used to have a vision acuity of 20, 80 to 20 over 100 before everything happened. Oh, wow. And progressively over the last seven years, it's gone down to less than 20 over 1600. Uh, and they did a low vision refraction with me at the University of Minnesota, but this was the best that they could do because they said if we continue to increase the, the magnification, it would start to distort because of the changes in the glasses and the curves. Mm -hmm. uh, because of that, these have actually been more so of a protective gear than more so of a visual <laughs> assistance. So. Um, for the last little while, we've been trying to figure out non-visual ways of doing things. I've actually figured out how to do my art form non-visually, which is actually an interesting concept. Um, I'm in the means of developing a program where people can do pixel art with no vision acuity. So. Oh my gosh, that's <laughs> unbelievable. 